Hi, hello all. Today let us see some of the important questions on the importance of being earnest written by Oscar Wilde. First question, the importance of being earnest was first premiered in the importance of being earnest was first premiered in 1895. Next one, Jack makes up a story about his brother Ernest dying in Jack makes up a story about his brother Ernest dying in in which country the answer is paris next one lady bracknell changes her mind about cicely's suitability to marry algernon when she learns of dash lady bracknell changes her mind about cicely's suitability to marry algernon when she learns of her fortunes next one what does algernon tell jack he has always suspected him of being dash what does Algernon tell Jack? He has always suspected him of being a Bunburyist. Next one. Name of Algernon's butler. Who is the butler of Algernon? The answer is Lane. Next one. At what age will Sicily become independent from Jack? At what age will Sicily become independent from Jack? The answer is 35. Next one, what is Jack's father's first name? What is Jack's father's first name? The answer is Ernest. Who left Jack in the handbag when he was a baby? Who left Jack in the handbag when he was a baby? The answer is Miss Prism. Next one, the cigarette case is gifted to Jack by? The, the answer is Cecily. And on the cigarette case, to dear Uncle Jack was written. Next one, why does Lane think it is not polite to listen to Algernon's piano playing? Why does Lane think it is not polite to listen to Algernon's piano playing? Because Algernon plays so badly. Next one, what leads Algernon to think Jack is leading a double life? What leads Algernon to think Jack is leading a double life? The answer is an inscription on the cigarette case. Next one, on what railway line Jack found as a baby? On what railway line Jack found as a baby? The answer is Brighton. Next one, both Algernon and Jack make an appointment with Dr. Chosbill to discuss what? Both Algernon and Jack make an appointment with Dr. Chosbill to discuss their christening. Next one. Where did old Mr. Thomas Cardew find Jack as a baby? Where did old Mr. Thomas Cardew find Jack as a baby? The answer is in a clock room at the railway station. In a clock room at the railway station. Next one. Whom does Algernon pretend to be when he shows up at Jack's house? Whom does Algernon pretend to be when he shows up at Jack's house? The answer is Ernest. Next one, what is Lady Bracknell's objection to Jack as a suitor to Gwendolyn? What is Lady Bracknell's objection to Jack as a suitor to Gwendolyn? The answer is he being an orphan. Next one, what does Jack say? It is very ungentlemanly thing to read. What does Jack say? It is very ungentlemanly thing to read. The answer is a private cigarette case. Next one, at first Jack tells Algernon that Cicely is his what? Cicely is his aunt. Next one, what does Jack call Lady Bracknell behind her back? What does Jack call Lady Bracknell behind her back? The answer is a gorgon. Next one, what is the name of Algernon's imaginary friend? What is the name of Algernon's imaginary friend? The answer is Bunbury. Next one. What sandwiches has Algernon made for Lady Bracknell? What sandwiches has Algernon made for Lady Bracknell? The answer is cucumber. Next one. Where is Jack's house in the country? Where is Jack's house in the country? The answer is Hertfordshire. Hertfordshire. Next one. Where has Cicely recorded her engagement to Jack's brother Ernest? Where has Cicely recorded her engagement to Jack's brother Ernest? The answer is in her diary. Next one. Divorces are made in heaven. Who said it? Divorces are made in heaven. Who said it? The answer is Algernon. Next one. What food does Cicely serve to Gwendolyn? What food does Cicely serve to Gwendolyn? The answer is cake. Next one. 
Next one, on what street is Algernon's Moncrief flat located? The answer is Half Moon Street. Next one, how long does Cicely tell Algernon they had already been engaged for when he asked her to marry him? The answer is three months. Next one, what is Cicely's last name? The answer is Cardew. Next one, why does Gwendolyn never travel without her, without her diary? The answer is to have something sensational to read in the train. Next one, who is Algernon's permanent invalid friend? Who is Algernon's permanent invalid friend? The answer is Bunbury. Next one, whose arrival does Algernon's butler, Lane, announce in the play's opening scene? The answer is Ernest Worthing. Ernest Worthing. Next one, what does Algernon call the practice of keeping an imaginary friend or relation? What does Algernon call the practice of keeping an imaginary friend or relation? The answer is Bunburyism. Next one, where does Algernon take Lady Bracknell in order to give Jack opportunity to propose to Gwendolyn? The answer is the music room. Next one, Miss Prism goes on a walk with Dash, leaving Cicely alone. Miss Prism goes on a walk with Dr. Chosbill. Next one, what does Algernon pretend to be when he visits Cicely at Hertfordshire? What does Algernon pretend to be when he visits Cicely at Hertfordshire? The answer is Ernest. Next one, upon his return to Hertfordshire, whose death does Jack announce to Miss Prism and Dr. Chosbill? The answer is Ernest. Next one, what arrangement does Jack make with Dr. Chosbill after announcing the death of Ernest? The answer is to re-christen himself as Ernest. Next one, as the play begins, what is Algernon doing? As the play begins, the Algernon was playing a piano. He is playing the piano. Next one, Gwendolyn and Cicely hold their tea time conversation in. Gwendolyn and Cicely hold their tea time conversation in, in the garden. Next one, Miss Prism is interested in Dr. Chosbill. Next one, Lane is Algernon's butler. Next one, how does Jack discover his father's name? He reads through the army list. Next one, what do Algernon and Jack want Chosbill to do? They want to christen them. Next one, what do Gwendolyn and Cicely needed for their husbands? The answer is they must be named Ernest. Next one, what are Cicely and Gwendolyn eager to do after leaving Algernon and Jack in the garden? The answer is forgive the men. Next one, what arrangement have Algernon and Jack both made winning them the complete forgiveness of Cicely and Gwendolyn? The answer is to re-christen themselves as Ernest. Next one, whose sudden arrival at the manor house cast the engagement of Cicely and Algernon into doubt? The answer is Lady Bracknell. Next one, what does Lady Bracknell accuse Miss Prism of having stolen 28 years ago? What does Lady Bracknell accuse Miss Prism of having stolen 28 years ago? The answer is a baby. Next one, what did Miss Prism confuse the baby with, causing her to place the baby in a handbag? The answer is a novel manuscript, a novel manuscript. Next one, who does the baby turn out to have been? The answer is Jack. Next one, what does Jack wrongly conclude upon realizing that he was the misplaced baby? What does the what does Jack wrongly conclude? The answer is, Prism is his mother. Next one, what was the name of the movement that embraced the principle of art for the sake of beauty and beauty alone? The answer is, aesthetism. Next one, at the end of the second act, Next one, at the end of the second act, Jack and Algernon fought for what food? The answer is, muffin. Next one, what position of public responsibility does Jack Worthing hold in Hertfordshire? 
what position of public responsibility does Jack Worthing hold in Hertfordshire? The answer is Justice of the Peace. Next one, what is the name of the fictional friend that Algernon Moncrief invents to avoid boring social situations? The answer is Bunbury. Next one, what plan does Algernon compare Sicily to in Act 2nd? The answer is a pink rose. Next one, who is Sicily's governess? The answer is Miss Prism. Next one, whom does Jack ask to marry him? Whom does Jack ask to marry him? The answer is Gwendolyn. Next one, the importance of being earnest consists of how many acts? The answer is three. Next one, what does Lady Bracknell describes as the primary duty of life? The answer is health. Next one, where does act three of the play take place? At the drawing room of the manor house. At the drawing room of the manor house. According to Gwendolyn, the name Ernest inspires dash. According to Gwendolyn, the name Ernest inspires absolute confidence. Next one, who speaks the first line of the play? Who speaks the first line of the play? Algernon. Next one, what is the nickname of Algernon? The answer is Algi. Next one, Gwendolyn say they live in an age of dash. Gwendolyn say they live in an age of ideals. Next one, what according to Wilde should strive to be useless? What according to Wilde should strive to be useless? The answer is art. Next one, why does Jack say he needs to make frequent trips to London? Why does Jack say he needs to make frequent trips to London? The answer is to rescue his brother Ernest from troubles. So here comes the end of this session. If you like this video and if you find it helpful, please do share among your friends. Subscribe and tap the bell icon for getting more videos. Thank you.